with AK Virtual Arms Training and Shooting Gallery. I'm here today with very cool gear to demo a couple of new muzzle brakes that are hitting the market. Don't get rolling? Yeah. All right, so the test of the VCG is gonna be with a Zastava M90. Okay, this is the 5.56 version of an AK-47. I'm gonna just do it with the plain old slant brake that comes with the gun for a couple of shots as a comparison, and then we'll, we'll break the video and we'll go to a little exchange and put the muzzle brake on it and try it again. Right here, I do have to pause a moment and explain one thing, all right? I did not have, and they're extremely rare, and there may not even be any in existence, a muzzle brake for a 5.56 AK. So what most people do up to now is they go out and they buy a 7.62 muzzle brake and they put it on their 5.56. Now, it will help, but it is an optimal. So you're gonna see a demo of a 7.62 muzzle brake on a 5.56 AK. I can visually see the difference. Don't just look for the muzzle rise. You can look at the muzzle rise, but also look at how the recoil is moving my body in the video. That's very telling. VCG is going to make for me an AK-47 556 specific muzzle brake that allows for the deviation of AK imports. I'm going to take it to the AK Masters competition this year and it's going to be made available to you too. All right. So now I'm going to do P two PSAs side by side, and this one is in fact, this is the, the standard that came with my PSAK, and now we have the VCG installed on the other PSAK. I'm going to go. with that 7.62. All right, I've got a couple of um, options here that I'm gonna shoot today. And then lastly, I'm going to demo the VCG and I'm gonna bring this closer so you can get a look at it. Muzzle brake on the AR. I'm using the same ammo in every one, PMC bronze. Okay, we're going hot. 